Welcome to Adventure Fun. <laughs> oh my goodness, it's that time again. We gotta see what's inside these goos here. We have a total of 13, including the Ultra King. Oh, well, the only king of the Hydras here. It's our King Hydra, and he's gonna be super cool because there's three levels of Adventure Fun. You got the goo uh, over here, the goo in the middle, and the goo on the left-hand side. So you wanna make sure you guys watch all the way through to find out just exactly what's in him. So let's get started with, uh, how about we goo with him first? So remember, it's Blazagon, but he's on ice, so we'll call him Ice Be Gone, Isagon. And if you remember, because he under the sea, man, what's inside of him, not only does he have his uh, rice beads inside, but remember everything else besides the rice beads? You have all these, like, sea creatures in there. If I can just get one to the surface. I mean, that's why it's revealed, because it just takes so long. We just ought to, like, cut them open now. Ah, oh, there's the fishy right there. And Sebastian's in here somewhere, too, I think, at least in some of them here. So that's what we got to deal with. Let's... Get them primed and open them up. Ah, my dinner, I forgot my guts. I don't want to get dicky and all the icky all over myself. This is serious business at Adventure Fun. We take our toys seriously, especially the goose. And you probably do too. I don't know if I ever cut rice before. Oh, there's an air pocket. Why is it going that? Now see, when I turn up, then it fills it in because the rice floats to the top, right? So if I keep him down, maybe all this will float to the top. It's gonna be a little bit tricksy because it's gonna come shooting out. Oh, there you go. It's just probably part of the skin, right? That's uh, this light blue color. Now we're gonna have to go all the way, guys, because there's just so much rice, it's just sticking to the skin on the inside. This ain't gonna work unless I go all the way. Oh, look at that, very colorful. Those sea creatures, that's cool. Now what do we say, there was a total of four of them inside? So if you look at the skin, the skin's light blue, and it's just probably leaching, or it's probably the goo inside, not the rice beads, but the water here, this goo stuff, is uh, just probably leaching from here. So here's part of the coral reef, or good grief, or seaweed, you know. Hey, seaweed's good for you, you know. It's got like plankton, no, it's got like chlorella in it. <laughs> and then you got the uh, eel, electric eel. Oh, okay, no. And then we've got, who else we got? We got the octopus, calamari. And then we got the other one, we got the purple fish. Those are really cool. I mean, it's, it's obscured by here. You have to squeeze it really tight to get it, you know, to squish up against the skin so you can actually see it. And the color, you know, of course, uh, against the blue, light blue, you can't really see it, but now you can see it. So there we go. Oh my gosh, we got a lot to do here, guys. We gotta get hustling. So there's the first one with Isagon. That's cool. I'm more excited about the uh, little trinkets inside, little toys there, little uh, sea creatures. Because, you know, we've seen the rice beads before in the color, which is cool. Um, let's do... Oh, you know what? Let's go with him. Let's go with our thrash. Now, what's inside of thrash? Oh, well, if I can get his scabies off. And he had the chomp attack. And what do you have? The spit attack? Oh, yeah. He had the little spit. And he just squeezes his head and fill it up with water. Okay, so the chomp attack. Yeah, 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 yeah. And then let's go ahead and... What? Oh, the green Orvi is gonna be so cool looking. And look, we got the same color octopus. I think it's orange. Yeah, you can't really tell. And I wonder if it's gonna be all the same little uh, uh, sea creatures inside of him and uh, with the Orbeez. Yeah. I don't think there's a wrong way, but we'll try the foot again. Ew, it's metallic green. That's weird, because I never really focused on that. I just thought, hey, he's got Orbeez in it, you know? But they doubled their goo. They had the metallic in there, and then also the Orbeez. Oh, metallic Orbeez, they absorb it? They look metallic-y at all? Here, let me do this. Oh, it looks a little bit metallic-y. Oh man, that is such a cool looking color, guys. i never seen green metallic like this. Oh, here we go. And we can't bounce this because otherwise I'm gonna get liquid goo everywhere. This is really weird. Usually it's always just Orbeez or like liquid goo, but not a mixture of it. Maybe the Orbeez didn't absorb all the goo. So we have leftover goo. We gotta look in there. <laughs> we need a scope. There's just gotta be more than just one. Oh, it's just so cool looking. Look how like metallic-y that is, it, the swirlies. It's the coolest goo I've seen in a long time. Maybe ever. It just mixed so well. Let's get the rest of these uh, sea creatures out. There's got to be more. Oh, yeah, there is. Okay, so you saw the octopus, right? Same as our Blazagon. So there's Mr. Octonaut. And look, there's Sebastian Gizman. Look at my color. I'm so embarrassed. <laughs> he's holding his breath. That's why he's turning blue. There's got to be more. There's supposed to be four in every single goo. You vote me in for mayor of YouTube. I promise uh, four in every single goo. Oh, these are cool. So remember, we've got the yellow eel, right? Same one. But we got a new one. We got a purple starfish. That's cool. 
Oh, I tell you, this is really cool goo. The metallic swirlies. The Orbeez is what kind of stood up, but man, the metallic swirls just cool. Next. Oh, uh, you know, as uh, between trash and I want to do blazing on. Okay. Okay, this one is corn syrup. <laughs> Guys, I don't think I'm going to get these little sea creatures out of the corn syrup with relative ease. Um, we'll see what we can do. Oh, it kind of looks metallic y. So, corn syrup, metallic corn syrup. That's cool. And then, you know, we got, we'll get the sea creatures out, but I'm going to have to go all the way around. It's just not going to be just one little cut. Yeah, this one's sticky. This one's not going to be easy, guys. I'm trying to be a professional goo surgeon here. <laughs> we do this so you guys don't have to. We don't recommend that you do this. Uh-uh. You're going to get it if you do. So, guys, we just wanted to show you because we're curious. I mean, you're always looking on the outside in, but what about the inside out? There you go. That's what we goo. Oh, well, look at this one. This one's different. That one's a different eel. And look at that. That is metallic goo, corn syrup, metallic corn syrup. I'll try to get you guys some, but it's really viscous. It's super wet. Oh, and it likes to stick to everything. Uh oh, it, well, that's the eel, and it's, it looks like a sick eel. It looks like a very grayish eel. And I don't know, can you guys really see? There is like metallic stuff in there. I'm busting my hump to get these, like, free these little sea creatures from his body. Oh, well, there's Sebastian. Go ahead and look at the goo right in the skin. Does that look just look better? I mean, it does look uh, metallic y to me, but trying to pull that out. So we got a green star, I think. <laughs> Oh, we got three. We've got to have four. And there's Sebastian. He's kind of, he looks pink. We're we supposed to have one more. It's our yellow calamari. So, so far, they do have variants in all of them. The same thing, pretty much. You know, the eels. You got one fish over here, which we haven't seen here. But if they don't vary in actual species here, then they will by color. Put in the comments below if you'd like me to get all the goo out. Oh, since none of you put it in the below, I guess I don't have to. <laughs> don't make me goo it. I don't want to goo it. Oh, but it is cool looking. If you can get the part where it shines, before you start touching it and it mats down it's really cool i don't know why it looks so metallic i wonder if the skin is metallic because i pull it out and i'm like i just ain't seeing it <laughs> <laughs> the skin, I think, is... Oh, this isn't gooing well. Uh, but look how pretty that is. Go ahead, pause it. Pause your uh, video here, guys, and uh, stare at it. Okay. Okay, guys, we'll wash those up. And, uh, but we got a few more that may have corn syrupy, so we'll just do it all at once. Okay, guys, we cleaned it off. Now you can see the uh, yellow uh, octopus and then the uh, blue-green eel. And then we got Sebastian, which he's on his back. I think that's his front there. Pink, and then we got the uh, green starfish. Cool. And then what we'll do is we'll just kind of like show them all at once just all the got the full collection i think we got all the colors um let's go ahead and do a uh, thrash this time in the gold uh, suit here well with the green armor remember what's inside of our thrash gold thrash Ooh, we got some uh, blue green orbies and uh where's his oh i i can see something in there we got uh, fish so we got fish inside of him did he come with fish no he came with fish so fish isn't proprietary to uh, the shark here you know i mean you guys put in the comments if you know you're getting the same thing with each one that you look in so don't open it we do that and just say yeah it's the same color or if they just mix it up moose just you know just has a big thing just in each queue you know Oh, that's a bit frothy. Oh, look at that. That's cool. It's got metallic uh, goo inside of this one, man. That's awesome. I got to go up here. I got to go, totally go into this. Oh, yeah. Look at that fishy right there. We got our first fish head. And then we got our yellow star. I feel like I'm like reading something off of Lucky Charms, you know. Green stars, yellow clovers, and uh, orange Sebastians. <laughs> oh, we got coral reef. That's cool. And then we got all our Orbeez there, guys. <laughs> Uh, that's a big Orby. Which one's cooler? I don't know. Uh, the uh, aqua green or aqua... I don't know if it's an aqua blue, but it's like a marine green and aqua blue for you. Ooh, I gotta do this right. Oh, yeah! <laughs> <laughs> cool. I don't know where we're going to put all these. We just got so much goo to do. And I think we are going to go with, let's do head popping. Fubu! I'm Fubu, Fubu, Fubu! Oh, that's right. He's got the plastic bottom, so he can stand on his own, you know. But what's inside of Fubu? Okay, you got blue uh, metallic swirlies, and uh, we got a yellow fish in there. Oh, but do we have a coral uh, reef, uh, grief, um, orange? See, that's going to be new. Okay, so I don't think we have an orange uh, coral, so I I'm glad Moose shakes it up, you know. I say I don't need to get Fugu. I got all the sea creatures and all the other ones. Yeah, but not this color here. Ooh, that's a shooter. Yee! <laughs> I think it's showering the goo, Mom. Yeah! Get that metallic swirl out of your head. You're not going to a punk rock concert tonight. I will tomorrow, Ma. 
<laughs> Look how cool that goo is. I've never seen anything light blue like that, metallically light blue. I ain't done so many goos. Maybe I did, but you know. <laughs> Look, he's all shrunk up. He just, he's got no air pocket to frame up. So we have to open him up on the other side. We'll get, uh, do a little incision there. And Fugu puffs up. Good for you, Fugu. Now we got to free your goo inside. All these creatures that you ate, we must set them free. Free, free, set them free. Okay, so they're all sitting right here. Okay, so we got the orange coral. Okay, super cool. And then we got the green fish. Yay! Oh, we got a light blue eel. Uh, mm, yeah, I think we already got him there. Yeah, we got him over with Blazagon, the fiery one. There's nothing new here, really, unless there's no green fish. We don't have a green fish, so we got a green fish. And we don't have an orange coral so so far they're keeping it uh you know different in some of these goose here shaking it up i'm excited for our uh shock exo shock oh, uh, i think we'll yeah see my bones see my bones uh, i could write lots of tones about my bones see my... yeah just close to the top no mystery there guys do we really need to open them well, we got it. Yeah, of course we do. You guys have already made it it's self known i i can feel you guys you guys saying open them up I'm like yeah i will okay I don't need to be told or commented twice on, open him up. <laughs> Here we go. It's just all clear liquid. Yeah, not much there. And then we got the, oh, but the bones. I don't want that to flick in my face. Look at that. <laughs> <laughs> little chicken with those kids. <laughs> or turkey. <laughs> it's Halloween, guys. Man, that'd be cool if you could actually have a battery and light this up. Poof, or it glows in the dark. You know, we need to have some of those. So do we have a pink star anywhere? I do not see. Oh, we do over here. Okay, so that's the same. Nothing different there. We have green fish. We have three fishes because the other one's over here. Oh, there's a green fish over here. Yeah, so it's the same. So we have the pink uh, starfish. And then we got the green fish. We have the orange coral. Oh, man. This dude's not producing, man. The, what about Sebastian? I mean, we got the bones, but I think is Sebastian new? Uh, the blue? Oh, we got dupes, guys. So you do have them bones. You got clear liquid, and you got some sea creatures. And he's got his little, like, thingy here. You know, turns on the lights so you can see at night when he's down in the deep. Okay, deep sea goo. Oh, boy, we're really getting down to the... Oh, we got to do suck face. Oh, there's some water on there. Oh, can you... Use... Oh, there you go. We got a little suckage there. What about his face? See, look at that. He's sucking. Oh, that was satisfying. His face, his face is even worse. <laughs> his face just isn't sticking to any, oh, it's totally collapsed. There's like a hole in his head. Well, no goo's coming out. We'll dip him in some like this goo. Oh, come on, he just ain't sucking, but his, his hands, they suck. I mean, not literally. I mean, they do literally, really guys, but his hands do stick. So that's cool. Okay, so let's go ahead and open them up. Can you remember what's inside of him? Three, two, one. Woo! Black Orbeez and clear ones. Remember, he can also stand on his own because it's cool. They got the tail propping him up here a little bit. Oh, man. I really love these sucker hands. I don't know how this is going to work. Let's see. Ooh. Okay, this one's different, guys, because they don't have a lot of metallic goo in here. I was uh, kind of concerned that I get a bunch of juice coming out, but man, black and clear Orbeez. Let's take a look at the black Orbeez. Um, let's go ahead and do a little incision there. Yeah, it's, uh, wow, it's a solid black through and through, guys. It's cool looking. Okay, let's see if we find any different uh, sea creatures. Uh, I think we found them all, but different colors that we haven't seen yet. Um, what about uh, octopus? I think yeah, that's, well, it's a color we've seen before, but not in the uh, octopus. Okay, do we have a pink eel? Uh, I don't think we had a pink eel before, guys. I think that's something new. Okay, so we're, we're getting some uh, new colors with the, or different colors with these uh, same species that we've seen before. Okay, we got a green uh, Sebastian. I have a green Sebastian. I don't think we have a green Sebastian, green Sebastian. Okay, woo! Wow, we're really scoring here. Last one, where is it? Oh, there it is. I can see it up there. An orange starfish. God, have we hit all new colors then? Because I don't recall seeing an orange starfish at all. So orange starfish, different. Green Sebastian's different. Uh, the purple eels, different. And then the blue green. Wow. So they can't keep doing this because they're only operating on uh, four colors, it looks like. Oh, except the yellow. Okay, we're missing the yellow, right? So five colors. This is goo for you. That's goo for you. It's good for me. You gotta come up with goo cereal. <laughs> Have the Orbeez in there. Just uh, it's totally sugar. Just pour milk and wait to pop overnight, and then you're ready to eat. <laughs> Whoa! I corn syrup here. This one's gonna be a bit tricksy. He doesn't stand on his own, but he's super goo. Now let's pull off the bottom. This one is going to be a cool goo to look at. Purple. It's probably not a deep, dark purple. And then there's the yellow Sebastian. God, we must have a yellow Sebastian. We came across the yellow Sebastian, right? We've hit all this. Yo, maybe not. Okay, we got his hook. <laughs> 
This is not gonna be easy with the goo. We'll just see how wet this goo is. I love purple goo. It's so goo looking. It's so wet. It's hard to like pull it away, the skin from the goo inside. Okay. There's the goo. It's not separating from the skin. It's purple. If I could just get a part of the skin, like this part right here, see, it's just dark gray. So it's the goo inside that you're seeing that's purple, which is super cool. It just looks cool without, you know, touching it. Just the uh, creature inside. Oh, look at that. <laughs> <laughs> That's cool looking goo. I really love the purple. So we got an orange eel. We got a yellow Sebastian. Oh, it's really sticking to me, isn't it? <laughs> Sebastian, unhand me. So we got the green octopus. I don't know what else. What's the final one in here? Okay, you want to take a look at that? Um, it's a light purple. I don't think uh, Gujitsu's ever had light purple, which is super cool. Where is the last one? Oh, man. Oh, this is... Guys, I'm being very, very thorough. Not there. Oh. So I didn't see it in the feet, so it's gotta be if it's here at all. It's getting harder, guys. This is nasty. I mean, you can see his neck. It looks pretty cool there. God, get more goo with every, like, pull on me. I don't know if that's something right there. Ugh. I hope I don't cut the creature in half if it, this is what I think it is. Oh, this is like one of the worst reveals for corn syrup, guys. This is getting like gooey. Oh, I see it. I hope you guys appreciate this because <laughs> it like it's already ripping off my glove. Okay, there's the blue fish uh, starfish here. Oh my goodness. We'll clean it up, give you guys a better look, but I ain't doing this anymore. Look, look why it lasts, guys. I ain't doing this. <laughs> I'm putting it down. That's all the goo there is. It's like some sort of spider webby goo. So there you go, guys. You got the uh, yellow Sebastian and then the orange. I never seen an orange eel before. And then the uh, blue starfish and then the green octopus. Puss. And that was really tough. He was fighting me. Evil people usually don't want to goo down like that. Let's do Batman or uh, Manta Man. Mantara. Yeah, I don't think you can get that off, but you can get the black belt off. Ooh, purple Orbeez, and I'm guessing it's metallic goo inside. Purple metallic goo. That looks super cool. Okay, we're ready. It's not purple Orbeez. It's like a light blue Orbeez, but the purple goo around it really changes it. It's really cool. It's a bit frothy. So there's the orange coral, purple uh, Sebastian, and then an orange fish. Hey, look at that. It's been pummeled some of that uh, Orbeez, just smashed and mushed. I didn't cut. You guys saw me. I said, this is live. <laughs> I didn't sit there mash and mush it. You got to go up the arm. Yeah, there's some Orbeez trapped in there. Okay, nothing. Kind of looks like like purple icy or something, you know, something you'd eat on a hot sunny day. Well, not this stuff. This is bad for goo. Okay, what? Oh, there it is. Okay, we got a. Uh, it's not yellow. It's a light green uh, starfish. Is it metallic -y squirrels? Yeah, the purple's got metallic squirrels. I really like the purple here a lot. I think that's my favorite so far. I mean, I like the other ones with the Orbeez and the metallic squirrels here. In fact, I think most of it's just kind of sitting there, but. But I think purple right now looks really cool, guys. We'll have to wait and see because we just have uh, four left. Now it's time for the uh, ultra rare. I popping fun. <laughs> Woo! Okay, do you remember what's inside of him? Okay, so we got rice beads and it looks like blue uh, liquid goo inside. Here we go. Ooh. Okay, yeah, it's blue goo. It's like popcorn, just the way it pops out of there. Okay, we're gonna go up the back. Why would you do that to an ultra rare? Because we gotta find out if there's ultra rare colors in here. <laughs> I bet they're all the same colors here. The only thing that made him ultra rare was his uh, popping eyes. Ew. Ooh, I think I just landed inside of one of the glasses of dishes. <laughs> We got a purple octopus here. We got a green eel. Then we got a yellow fish. Okay, I don't think, um, do we have a yellow fish? I'm looking, I'm looking. I don't think we have a yellow fish anywhere. That's what you get in Ultra Rare to get a yellow fish. It's worth getting. And then you got a blue coral. I don't think we got blue coral anywhere, guys. Well, okay, guys, looks like we got some unique colors with the uh, sea creatures here in the Ultra Rare. And I like the blue goo. Oh man, we're getting down to the big king of the goos. Now we got to do the split personalities. Let's do bold breath. Yeah! Take the bold breath, Boeing. Take him, Boeing. Okay, remember the goo's inside here, guys? 
Ooh, we got the purple squirrels and the green. Um, it looks green. I think it's the actual green goo inside. Rice. So how are we going to do this, guys? Do we just go ahead and just mix it all straight across, or do you want to do a separation first? I think we better do a separation first, and then we'll mix it after. Just like Ghostbusters, guys. When you're catching ghosts, you don't cross the streamers with your uh, laser streamer guns. You don't mix goos. You got to do this right. The fish head pop. There we go. Woo! Fishy coming out. Okay, so first the purple goo. Oh, <laughs> it got goo all over me. And remember, these don't have any sea creatures inside of them. I mean, with all this goo, you're just too busy playing with this much goo to have a sea creature to worry about, right? That was a lot. That was a bit troublesome. Okay, now for the other side. Here we go. Oh, wow. It's yellow. And there's your rice. Oh, yeah. More down at the bottom here. Oh, it's just like kind of the snow. That snow, powder snow, you add water to it, it just puffs up. That kind of reminds me of it to here. This is up at the top. Okay, guys, if we mix it, there's no going back. Yeah, I, I see it. I read it in your comments. Okay, here we go, guys. No going back. A couple of you guys asked the question saying, will it breach this? And if you squeeze it long enough, I think there's a pretty thick wall there. It doesn't breach it. So this is what happens if you do have a security breach. What happens when you mix yellow and purple? You get something gross. Um, you kind of get maybe a little bit of a, mm, well, it's a different color purple here than what I expected. Well, then you see the purple on the table. <laughs> so it's got the metallic -y beads. So it doesn't look as cool like that, I don't think. I like the separation of the yellow and then the actual purple you see on the table. Let's do a cross because then you can actually see the inside better from the cross section than going up because you don't know how thick the sea. Oh, look at that. Guys, that is totally thick. That will not breach. After 10,000 squeezes, <laughs> it will breach. <laughs> I don't know, it looks like it's thicker, it's as thick as the skin, but just because the color is white, for some reason, I just think that's just more solid. It's just a solid, so, you know, it's more likely you'll break it on the outside because of the squeezing and the rubbing than you probably would on the inside. But if you do, you wake up the next day and you're like, hey, got new goo! <laughs> it's like, what happened to the left and the right? They become one. Now, I'm kind of getting used to the color. It's got a red tint to it a little bit, you know, yellow-ish with the purple here. Oh, that's fascinating. Now this one, you ain't gonna get the same response. I mean, you got the liquid goo over here with our tyro, but you got, oh, you got the corn syrup there, guys. So um, I don't have to pull out any bugs inside of them here, sea creatures, but here we go. Now that's cool. I love that metallic red. That one's gonna be cool. Okay, let's go ahead and do that one. Um, I think we ought to do this first. Oh yeah, remember this. It's popping fun. There we go. Okay, let's do for the foot. I'm pointing at the camera mom so it hits the camera, not me. Ooh, wow. Well, that's kind of pretty. <laughs> it probably doesn't pick up very well on the table here because the light shining down on the white table is so bright. It's just the lens starts like freaking out. And so you don't get a true color. But look at this color. This looks really cool, guys. It's red, but a hint of orange to it. And then now for the other side, you can see it ain't going over. I mean, I could cut in the middle. You're gonna see the same thing, right? I don't think they're gonna see, uh, but let's just. You got it. Ooh, right, oh wow, right in the middle, guys. Uh, that'd be cool if we could have poked it and not have it come out. Okay, yeah, he's like an alien coming out. Oh, that's actually kind of cool looking. If I don't touch it, mat it down, it's pretty cool looking goo. Usually is almost any goo that you first time you, you know, get it out into the open. It just, it, it looks cool. Kind of reminds me of just uh, a little bit of deep space, a little bit of the blue out there. It looks like he's got little stars, but it's just air bubbles in there. I'll try to pull it out, guys. Oh yeah, this isn't, why? <laughs> it's like, why do they have to be so viscous? I'll try to put a little bit in here in the soup. We just, look, we made curry in a hurry. And now you got some deep sea goo. We call it goo curry. You like, you subscribe, we deliver. <laughs> it ain't coming off. Okay, camera mom, use your extra finger to, now you, you touch it, it's gonna be all over you in the camera. I'll just see if I can let it drop. I just wanna mix a little bit in there. You gotta have a little mixture, right guys? Okay, that's as goose it's gonna get. 
That's our coral reef inside the uh, orange sea goo. Oh, look at that, that is so stranny. Man, that is really nasty goo, guys. Yeah, it just is, it is a fanny pack in the front. <laughs> go. I like it like that. If I try to pull it out, you, you can see what happens. Just a mess. Okay, King Hydra, what you've been waiting for, or at least what I've been waiting for. Pull this trident out. There we go. And then off the bottom here. Okay, so we know we got to have at least two plates because uh, you got the left side, which is going to be, uh, let's see, metallic, if I can squeeze it right. Ooh, really cool metallic blue. Super cool metallic blue, guys. That's awesome. And then the middle, you just got some light um, bluish green Orbeez, okay? And then, so we just need two plates for that because the final one that you see here is just gonna be the purple corn syrup. And I, I could get another plate, but is it really worth it? We'll find out. <laughs> That's so fun to do that. Even if I destroyed the goo and everything, you know, after, oh, 10,000 like squeezes and it's all mess and broken, this would still be a collector's item, you know, just trim the bottom off and you can still have your fun. Woo! <laughs> okay, so here we go, guys. We're gonna have to start with the his left side, his pinchies, or his foot. Uh, well, if I put it over here, I'm gonna try to make a little decision so it doesn't like pop all over the place. Ugh. Whoa. They're so big. Oh, almost spoodered my man here. Oh, look how deep blue that is. That is deep sea goo blue, guys. That is the deepest blue I remember ever in Goo Jitsu's. Oh my gosh, that's really deep blue. That's a lot of goo too. Oh wow. All the incisions and it's just not all like, I have to squeeze it though. Wow, that is so cool. Oh, wow, that is really cool. And it's metallic -y blue. Look at it swirl and wave. I mean, that's the deepest blue ocean I've ever seen. King Hydra, yeah, he was hoarding all the cool blue. That's cool. I, I love it. Okay, so what are we going to do next? Oh, we got to lift this up. Oh, this table is going to be so stained. <laughs> I don't know if Mr. Clean can help us out. We'll put him to the test. Okay, now for the Orbeez. Should we just turn him on to see how much pain he's in? <laughs> What? Dude, I get the last laugh. <laughs> he angy. He don't want me to do this. If we, we, we do it for the tail, maybe we can shoot him out through the tail. Okay. Oh. oh. <laughs> <laughs> Boo. Oh. <laughs> okay. We got to have one to... Oh, I can't get it on the plate. There's one. Oh, maybe that wasn't a good idea. Dude, that was fun, but you guys got to have at least a few samples. They're just bouncing all over the place. Oh, wow. Oh, well, you're even picking up this and it's just, oh, oh man. Okay, well, there's the separator that you saw in the other goo that we revealed right there. So, you know, that's no mystery. But this, let's go across and break into the purple. <sighs> you can do it. <laughs> like it's every goo has been just, oh, let's try this. Oh, that's kind of cool. I mean, it was a clean cut. It didn't stick to the scissors. So that's a good start. Oh, well, kind of is now. What are you made up of, King Hydra? Fishes and spice and everything are nice. <laughs> so his skin is actually just the same color. It's all the way through, same color. So the only thing that's changing is the goo inside and it's purple. You guys ready for this? I'll do what I can. Oh, it's a cool purple. It's a cool looking purple. It just reminds me of having a grape lollipop sucker. Uh, oh, it does. Very great. Uh, oh, I just... Ah, present yourself. <laughs> That's cool. Of all the corn syrup, this is the coolest one, I think. Um, that one was okay. The light purple, but the dark purple. And I just... I, I'm craving a grape lollipop. Okay, I'm just trying to see just how much I can get out of him. It just it's not going to work really easily. Oh, there you go. Oh, that's it, Goose. Oh, <laughs> getting Orbeez all over the place. This is like the worst goo reveal that I've ever done. It's just, look at this. Can you believe that, guys? If you like what you see, 
Go ahead and like and subscribe. <laughs> There's nothing I wouldn't goo for you, and you can goo for us. Be sure to uh, you know put in the comments what you think. Which one's your favorite ones? Mine's the purple here. Uh, the metallic swirls with the Orbeez uh, with Mantara. And then it kind of goes into the green because it had metallic. Just the metallic swirls seem really cool. I mean, that's unique with the uh, black and the white Orbeez. And then you got just some metallic swirls, blue, green, and um, and then you got all these like different little uh, sea creatures here of, you know, at least five colors that we're going through. Maybe there's six. I haven't counted them all up, but guys, it was fun. Thanks for watching. Be sure to like and subscribe because as more goo comes out, we'll be ready. And we hope goo will too. Thanks for watching, guys. Now onto the Fortnite challenge where I got to win in a deep sea goo scan. Well, it's about the goo inside. And he's got something inside that I want to show you guys. It's an emote that only he can use if you win a game. And you want to stay till the end because it shows what's inside of our Roman candle here. And it's maddening cool. Man, and my firecracker is ready to go off. A fuse lit and so he's ready to like explode. <laughs> and so I got out of place. I want to land here. Jump. And actually, instead of the marker, I want to hit these monoliths that I see. These uh, structures, monuments, these like, well, if you'll see them just a minute, right there. These tombstones. <laughs> I like the glider just whistling, going off. Wee -wee. Everybody else can hear you that's around you. And so, man, scares them. They're like, I don't want to land where he's landing. This guy may go off. <laughs> so, look at his toes. They're all burning. So there's a lot of chests around here, but I just wonder how good the loot's going to be. Oh, key, that's not bad. Um, some explosives, mini. Yeah, I guess more jump pads, chest. I'm gonna take a mini right here. I'm gonna take the scope to burst assault rifle and also the uh, battle briefcase and rearrange my loadout. And then any more chests around here? Uh, just pick up some ammo and get the shotgun and. I think that's it. We'll just head over across the uh, river here. Oh, shockwaves. I'll take those. More ammo. Get some more uh, shield. Oh, got a chest up here. More shockwaves. Nice. And a thermal DMR. Upgraded or up leveled up. We'll go ahead and use the uh, mini SMG scoped. Naughty, naughty nets. Naughty, naughty. Oh, naughty, naughty. I don't see anything. That's probably already been looted. No, shockwaves. Nope. It's just sitting here for the taking. You know, I'll go with the Maven. There's a chest here somewhere. Oh, under the stairs. And let's go ahead and take a potty break. Hopefully nobody snuffs my fuse out. So yeah, the infiltrator pump shotgun is pretty good. Actually, uh, even from a distance, I've gotten some good damage on it. Or right, ammo. Huh, <laughs> birdie. Oh, ah, hey, yeah, it's one of those fuses that just doesn't die out in the water. Cool. Even my toes are still lit. Nice. Can't extinguish this fuse. I may have a short one. It will not be extinguished. Go ahead, snuff my fuse. You can't do it. Let's see if somebody feng shui this place cleans it up. No, nope, it's available. Yay. Oh, not much loot. Should we go ahead and rock it to the air? That's right. We're a Roman candle. We're going to rock it in three, uh, one. Ooh. <laughs> yeah. Incoming. Woo. It'd be cool if I had one of those rockets just came in with this and exploded. Kind of a kamikaze mission, you know. But if I got the last person, you know, give me a win. Oh, he's coming in hot, isn't he? This is a pretty good shotgun from this. Okay, 27. There we go. It's a pretty good shotgun from distance. You know, it's more damage than I've seen with other shotguns. Or that I remember lately. <laughs> Man, I would do a challenge now and say try to win with the worst loot in the game. Although I can't say it's that bad. I do have uh, some epics. There's one on the flow and there's one in my uh, inventory. Let's go down. Well, yeah, I do kind of blend in with the roof, yeah. So somebody saw me up there, they just go, hey, it's just part of the roof, man. It's a little bit on fire, but you know. 
Let's do uh, first shotgun. Sounds like a Rambo movie. First blood, part two. First shotgun, part one. Verse A, stanza nine, line six. Oh, somebody's over there. I think they're gonna take out the guards, get the key, and then know where the next storm's coming in. Oh, I think I hit a guard. Oh yeah, there's the boss. And that, oh, that's actually, did they take out the dude? Just take out these guys. One down, get the boss, get the boss. Get the guards, get the guards. You guys are just shooting the ground in front of me. This is fun. I don't have to work that hard. <laughs> yeah, you just hit after hit after hit. No one hit wonder for me. Oh. Ooh, he's going down fast now. Okay, great. Let's go get the card. Once I get the card, shockwave, I'm able to use it to activate so I can see future storms. Ooh, that's tempting to get the twin mag assault rifle, but uh, I have buyer's remorse, buyer's remorse. Oh, where's the key card? Oh, there it is. Okay. There it is, a big satellite dish. I can track the storm. Nice, now I can see into the future. Let's roll that, oh, on the go bag. One of the best augs in Fortnite at this time. Man, are my fingertips on fire too? I haven't noticed that before. Ooh, okay. Yeah, bye-bye. You can see in the upper right hand corner, guys, that circle's flashing. Hasn't formed yet, but I can see it because of the big antenna that I caught. Predicts or tells me when the next circle's gonna form. So I can kind of get ahead of the game, as it were. Okay, there's the second circle. Gonna make my way to it. Um, we got eliminated. Five players left. And that dude up on the tower there. Ooh, got him. <laughs> That's about all I'm gonna get out of him. I'm just gonna keep going to the next uh, circle here. Okay, four players left. It's getting a little spicy. Let's go. Okay, three players left. Ooh, hello. Oh, those other footsteps must be your bot friend that you hired. Just keep running. Gotta slow down so you can't hear me. Oh, there you are. Bye bye. Yeah, coming in hot after me. I'm the one that's on burning here. Okay, are they just trying to goad me in? No, it sounds legit. I'll just go ahead and sneak up on them. Ooh, somebody's got a crown. They're right there. 1v1. Ooh, bye-bye. Ow. Again. Okay, take coverage. Oh, I'm glad I brought the slurps along. Could have slapped it, but now the slurp will get me going. You gotta keep ahead of the dude. Ooh, he's trying to snipe me? I think he's snipe happy. Uh, I know I'm still filling up, but hey, I'm just gonna quickly get this going here. Let's go. And I know where the next circle's going. You don't. <laughs> this may become very advantageous. Uh, bush bombs, those will work. Let's throw one down here for faux coverage, uh, false coverage, so you won't know. So I can throw this one down here and have to pick between the two. He ain't coming after me. I think he really just wants to snipe. Okay, so there's the circle and there's the new circle. It's getting smaller, so I'll mark where I have to go. So I think I got a plan. You see that yellow taxi there? I'm gonna like heist it. Make my way to the circle as fast as I can as soon as it starts shifting on me. Give me a little bit of coverage. Let's go. Oh, it's a truck. Let's trick him. I got a truck, haha. Uh -huh. <laughs> okay. All right, let's make our way to the circle.
it'll back up. It's not backing up. I gotta get out of here. That's not good being a sitting duck. Oh, I hear him. Shockwave. Oh, you got the turret. You set up the turret, just... Okay. Yes! Alright! I gotta get the emote, get the emote. It's not on this page, where's the emote? Emote? There he is. Here you go, guys. What's inside the deep sea goo? Here it is. For the... <laughs> That's just a great emote. That's so cool, guys. Thanks for watching. Be sure to like and subscribe. We got more goo for you. Please click on one of these videos for more events of fun.